just seen this post on TikTok and it said that if your man's homeboys try to fuck with you or flirt with you on some shit, then that means that his homeboys know that he cheated on you and that's why he's so comfortable. And I'm not gonna lie, it started to make sense. I just seen this post on TikTok and it said that. I cannot deny nor confirm the statements that have been. Hey, bro, that is one of my worst fears. You know what? No, I'm lying. My worst fear is going to use the toilet and seeing a snake come out of it. That's my worst fear. I'm going to keep it 100 with you. If I see a snake... Knock on wood, bro. I don't want. I don't want to talk it up. I don't want to talk it up. So I ain't gonna say it because sometimes you you say shit and you speak it into existence, and I I don't want to do that today. Does body count matter? I feel like no, but to each his own. Oh, would you take back a cheater? It depends on the situation. Like if he had no reason to cheat, like, and I'm not saying like people have reasons to cheat, but like if shit happens, then, you know we ain't really like close knit like how we was. Okay. What's some red flags in men that you think they should change? I would say getting opinions from their friends, their homeboys, stuff like that. And not holding themselves accountable. Does body count matter? I feel Yo, like no. I'm going to keep it 100, bro. I didn't hear nothing she just said. I didn't hear nothing she just said. Cause I, I'm, I'm finna say some. Them, them things was out, man. Hello, what's your name? Alanis. Hello, what's Clark your name? Clark Atlanta Sorry. University. Uh, what is three times three times three? Nine. Three times three is nine. <laughs> nine. Nine times three is eighteen. Is answer? Yes. Nine. That's not right. Three times three. Oh, three times three times 18. Three. three times three is nine. Nine times three is 18. It's 18. Okay, okay. Hello, what's your name? Alanis. I got 27. Clark Atlanta University. That's where my wife went to school. I used to be on Clark campus damn near every weekend. Remember them days. Because... I'm in my healing stage. Huh? I'm in my healing stage. Like, we could be friends and go for narrow. Why not? How are you? 18. Like, what's wrong with that, though? I can't do it. I just can't. I can't even have her. I don't know. I got an IG? I don't even have IG. What's up, Smitty? You got? Snapchat. That's wild. I'm in my healing stage. I think that's the most dangerous stage of womanhood. That means that uh, she just broke somebody's heart. That's at A. Hey, that's actually... Around the age when that happens. I, I said it before and I'm going to say it again, man. Y'all young boys in high school with these girlfriends. Listen. On the day of graduation, let her go free. Because if it's meant to be, she'll come back. Because what's going to happen is you're going to go to college. She's going to go to college. You're going to you gonna do your thing. She may not find out. She might find out. But when she do her thing. Oh, you gonna feel it. High school and college is when most men experience their first heartbreak. Now, not all, but most. Your first heartbreak. All that little nonsense in junior high school and, and, and elementary school, that don't count. But high school... You know what I'm saying? Because there's a chance you was, hit, you was tapping that ass. You might have took her virginity and all that. Yeah. <laughs> so he can't feel her trying to use his finger to open his phone? He can't feel her trying to use his finger to open his phone? 
Is he asleep? Oh, he's asleep. Oh. Bruh. Oh, he just woke up. Yeah. If you gotta go through all that, bro, just go ahead and leave him, shawty. Go ahead and leave him. Ain't no point in going through all of that. She really out there on her FBI, James Bond, CIA. She wildin', son. Why he quoting? Pastor turned into a battle rapper. Pastor need to stop watching that smack. <laughs> Smrrr. He in the church service spitting battle rap bars. Controversial. You know when you go to like CVS or Target or something, it'll be like, donate $5 to blah, 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 charity. Yeah. I don't say yeah, yeah anymore. Because I learned they've already paid this charity and you're paying the corporation back. What the hell? Yeah. So every time they're like, oh, $5 to blah, 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 blah. Target already paid. You're now paying Target back. And Controversial. You know when you go to like CVS or Target or something? I have been saying yes. Because I, I feel more charitable. But this is good information to have. This is good information to know. This guy I'm out with is actually younger than I thought he was. <laughs> he's 26. Anyway, he's across the street right now getting me pizza. <laughs> so, it's not a total loss. This guy... I'm not going to lie. In my 20s, I wanted to take down something that was about 40. I think I think it came from watching too much of them blues movies. Older woman, young guy. Yeah, I want to re-experience that. And she's actually attractive, so I don't blame him. <laughs> 